Hi everyone, my name is Misu Ho. I am a library officer at Kingston Libraries. Today I'd like to share with you a cookbook that I love, which is Simple by Yokto Motolengi. What I like about this book is that it has lots of beautiful pictures, which is great because I want to know how the recipe is supposed to look like after it's done. It also tells you if the recipes can be made ahead and how long in advance this can be done, like up to 6 hours, 2 days, etc. Which is useful if you have to prepare lots of food for a dinner party, for example. There are 130 recipes in this book and many of them are plant-based. If you are trying to be healthy and eat more vegetables, but also want something satisfying and tasty to eat, this book may be for you. Growing up, I did not use a lot of herbs in cooking, so I didn't know which herbs and spices go well together. This book really taught me how to incorporate herbs and spices into my daily cooking. This book shows you a creative way to use herbs and spices to make vegetables more flavorful. And because spices and herbs give so much flavor in the foods, I could reduce the amount of salt and sugar when cooking these recipes. One of the recipes I just love making is hot chow cherry tomato with cold yogurt. The combination of hot tomato with flavor of cumin, thyme, oregano, and cold yogurt works so well together. The book also includes some dessert recipes. Here I tried baking blueberry and lemon cake, it's a very simple recipe that uses less than 10 ingredients. You can mix all the dry and wet ingredients together, add the blueberry at the end, and bake it for half an hour. It's a simple loaf cake that is quick and easy to make. It also keeps well for 3 days in the room temperature. Yeah, so overall I highly recommend this book. I tried many recipes and they all tasted delicious and they were easy to make. So if you are interested in this book, it's available to download on Bolo Box through Kingston Libraries. Thank you for watching.